lashes did my brows I don't have any makeup on I wore jewelry like hello Brittany you're wearing jewelry I'm trying to get into jewelry more but like dainty jewelry I like really simple small aesthetic dainty jewelry but I don't like too much of it even when it's small I don't like too much of it so um, yeah I still have my necklace I mean my bracelet from TJ Maxx, I freaking love this bracelet. Like, trust and believe I'm getting Van Cleef. Like, you know, I'm gonna eventually get Van Cleef, but this is definitely giving Van Cleef in the meantime. And then um, this necklace came from H&M. I keep forgetting, but it's the trio necklace that's all in one. But everything is just so dainty and small and I love it. And of course, my ring, I always wear my ring. But y'all, I'm missing an earring, so I really need to get some earrings. The problem is I only like studs. I do not do hoops. Um, I do not do hoops of any sort. So I just don't like, you know, wearing hoops. Um, so I need to find some good studs. And my hair is like, whatever. But it's super long. It's, it's long to me. Like, I could have like went down shorter, but Whatever, I'm not gonna worry about it for now. You guys, I'm so excited because I ordered some stuff. <laughs> I ordered some stuff. I keep ordering stuff, but I'm here for it because y'all, this year, I just wanna live luxury, like happy, full life, a fulfilled, luxurious life. This year, um, full of experiences, like, Last year, I was so caught up into home decor. I keep stressing out, but like I literally look back on my life last year and I didn't do anything as far as like go out. Like I did travel, I'm not gonna lie, like I did travel, but I wanna travel more. I wanna do like more experiences, more, just more everything. So more treating myself, like literally treating myself. And that's what I've been doing, so. I definitely ordered a new lip gloss. I cannot wait to share with you guys when it comes in. And I just been ordering some stuff for me and just, you know, treating myself. Why not? But let me share with you guys something real quick. I actually have a couple of things to share with you guys today. Um, as they get delivered, I'm gonna share them, but this came last week, I think. Look, crate and bevel. Crate, crate and bevel. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying it like that, but look at it oh my gosh i got my first my first wedding gift i am so excited so let me know i asked you guys on my instagram do you want me to do a wedding haul or wedding gift haul or a wedding gift unboxing i don't know what to call it but like basically do you want me to save my gifts and like open them up now, depending on how much we get, it might be like, you know, what part one, part two, whatever. But I think I'm just going to wait and gather up a few gifts and then like do a haul. You know, like I feel like this is like early. Like I got this gift like a week or so ago and I just feel like it's kind of early. So I want to save it. But I'm anxious. I'm anxious. Y'all, Crayon Bell. Crate and Barrel and Target is on my wedding regist registry. <laughs> and all the stuff on there I want. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. There's a lot of stuff on there. Now, Crate and Barrel is a little up there. Y'all know Crate and Barrel is kind of expensive. Like, you know, I got a few things on there. But Target, of course, y'all know I had to get Target re wedding registry. Y'all know. And Crate and Barrel. So I'm excited to do an unboxing. Yay! So excited! First wedding gift, first wedding gift, uh, 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 
I'm excited. Okay, so I'm gonna put that to the side. I'm gonna put that to the side and let them accumulate, okay? Because I'll do a haul. I actually have a luxury collective haul coming too because I just been buying certain things and some stuff that you guys already seen, but I've been keeping the packaging to some stuff to make sure like uh, when I do my luxury haul, I can show you guys how it came and everything. I've never done a luxury haul like, oh, girl, you growing up. I, I've never done a luxury haul, so I'm excited to do one. Um, so yeah, that's coming soon as well. And y'all, please forgive me for my posting. Like I do, I, like, okay, like, I'm trying, I'm trying to stay, I'm, I'm trying to stay up with it. I just got a lot of stuff going on. Trust me, after the wedding, it's gonna be another shift because I actually want to start doing more business, but not on social media. Well, I do wanna still do business. I have my virtual assistant still like, you know, coming in with brand deals and stuff like that. But I actually wanna like shift into like a storefront. I don't know, y'all. I, 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 there's so much stuff, but I'll get into that later. I mean, these are things that I've been thought about. I'm just sharing it with you guys now, but these are things that I've been thinking about that I want to do. I'm literally just waiting for the wedding to be over so that I can like fully focus on certain things because like the wedding is kind of like all I can think about with it being almost April. Like it, today's Tuesday, April will be Friday. So like I really cannot think about nothing else about this wedding. Speaking of this wedding, Oh, I got my nails, look, oh, look at, I'm forgetting everything, look y'all, look at my nails. So I did my nails, y'all, look at how cute they are. They're long, they kind of long, <laughs> they kind of long, and um, these are my press-ons from, these are my press-ons from Bear, the Kiss ones I showed you guys before my last haul. So cute, so aesthetic, like they're so freaking cute. I love them. They're like a nudie color, but like, I don't know, kind of see-through still. Like, I don't know, they're really cute. But anyway, speaking of Amazon and speaking of the wedding, I want to share with you guys something that literally just came in today. So, Macy got her dress. I don't know if I mentioned this, but um, the girls, I'm still trying to figure out if they're gonna be actually walking in the wedding or they're just gonna be like standing on the side. I'm kinda nervous. Babe and I are both nervous about Macy walking down the aisle, child. I don't know if she's gonna act up, but I got her a dress nevertheless, so I'm gonna share with you guys. When a big, I also have the big girls' dresses, but um, they're not here yet, so when they come in, I'll show you guys those as well. But look at Macy's dress. I ordered, my mom ordered this off of Amazon, and y'all, the quality, let me push y'all back. Let me push y'all back. Let me push y'all back shot so y'all can see this, okay? Look at this dress. Like, can y'all see the detail? This is in a size 3T, which I'm so glad I got in a 3T because dresses seem to run big, so I always get like the size below. But look at the straps. Like, look at the straps. Look at the back. Oh my gosh, look at the back. Look, look at it. Now this is a big tool skirt. Like, it has so many layers. One, two, three, four, five. Like, it has so many layers inside of this dress. It looks so freaking cute. Like, oh my gosh, look at it. Look at this dress, y'all. I don't know if y'all can see if it's too dark. It is so cute. The detail is so cute. It is in the color ivory. So it's not like white, white. It is in the color ivory. Look how cute it is. I cannot wait to see Macy in this dress. She loves dresses. Like, Macy loves dresses. So I'm so excited. I'm happy that she loves dresses because all she does is twirl. So she's gonna look so cute. I'm getting her hair done too. I'm getting all the kids' hair done. But oh my gosh, the picture is like, oh, it's gonna be so cute. <laughs> so cute, so cute. Look at Macy's dress. Y'all, it looks perfect. Like, oh my gosh, stunning, stunning, stunning. It came with these um, pins on it just in case you wanna like pin the bow. But I just think it looks so cute. Like, what? Oh my gosh, like the. And this dress is heavy. This dress is so heavy. 
Oh my gosh, oh, it's so cute. I'm gonna leave it linked below because y'all sleep on Amazon. Please don't sleep on Amazon for your like stuff, like wedding needs. Like I know it's a wedding, but to me, it's like, I don't, I, I think I've said this before, but like certain things I'm not like literally about to just spend a lot of money on when I know I can like get it for cheaper or I can make it myself. Y'all see me make my um, bridal shoes. Those are not my wedding shoes, like the ones I'm gonna be walking down the aisle, but they are shoes that I'm gonna be walking in during my bachelorette, my bridal shower, like 20 bucks, literally 20 bucks shoes, okay? Like what? I'm gonna be cutting ends wherever I can because weddings are expensive. I mean, granted like you can spend less money on a wedding but for us our wedding is expensive so i'm you know i'm just gonna cut ends where i need to or where i can so my mom ordered macy's dress and it came out perfect like oh my gosh look at the detail like oh my gosh this is stunning because it's heavy like i thought it was gonna be a cheap dress don't get me wrong like you never know but this is beautiful like beautiful hopefully the straps fit her um she hasn't tried it on yet she's at school but hopefully the dress fits her like um neckline and it's not like too low right here but even if it is i'll just have the straps taken in like super easy fix cute i love it super cute oh i put on her hanger for her super super cute Okay, so now I'm about to head out to the store, so I will see you guys when I get to, to the store. <laughs> All right, I got my Starbucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got my Starbucks, and I actually got a sandwich. <laughs> I got a croissant and cheese. Yeah, so I got a croissant and cheese. I'm just sitting here eating my um breakfast real quick i got me my strawberry side lemonade venti do you guys sit in your car and eat before you go into target it's so weird okay so this is what i do target is on the street right but there's always like a starbucks nearby obviously there's a starbucks inside of target but i just feel like i don't want to eat and drink while i'm shopping i just that's not enjoyable to me and I don't want to go into Target to get my Starbucks, go back into my car, then go back into Target. Like, that don't make no sense. So right now, I'm just sitting here eating, and then I'm going to go to Target. Okay, excuse my windshield. It's dirty because of all the pollen. But look at these um, cherry blossoms. They look so cute. So beautiful. Anyways, I'm about to finish my food, and then we're going to go to Target. Max right now. I'm gonna be looking at some candles. Um, I ended up getting some jewelry I'm gonna share with you guys. I have a haul to share you guys to share with you guys once I get back to the house because I could not film in HM. I didn't get in copyright and I just don't want to deal with it because you know places like Zara and HM actually have like actual music playing and I just don't want to get copyright so I don't film when I'm in those stores, but I will do a try on haul once I, you know, get back to the house. So I am looking for some candles. Um, I smelled this one, the lemon verbena, but it, didn't, it wasn't hitting that hard. You know, I like my candles to be rather potent. Sand and fog never disappoints, so let me smell the island orchid. I'm not a fan. I'm going for something. I'm going for something like spring, but like lemony too. Um, they have this one, the lemon verbena, but it's so small. Mm, this one smells so good, but it's so small. And it's only $7.99, but mm, it smells so good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this one. They have vanilla and orange. Mmm, this, yo, this one, vanilla and orange, oh my gosh. It smells so good. Mm, give me this. Lemon apple. Let's see. Let me see. Mmm, don't like this one. 
Okay, I don't really see anything else um, other than the two that I picked out. Um, let's see. Sensational has big candles, but they, I don't think they smell like potent enough for me. There are mirrors. I think this mirror for $50 is such a good deal. I'm like, what? I got the gold one too. I think Target was selling mirrors for like 80 something. Even this one. $39.99 for this arch gold mirror. Like, ooh, it is out the pack. But that's even better, chap. Y'all can see it now. $39.99. What a steal. Ooh, even this is pretty. These are pretty. All right, we're in Target. We're in Target, y'all. Um, I'm actually gonna hurry up and film because my camera's dying, but I'm getting some leggings, some just some regular black leggings for the girls. I'll put y'all right here. Um, so, a little rant while I'm in Target. I feel like the clothes, okay, so our girls, our older girls, they wear, big sizes like they're 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 bigger kids you know they're not some small skinny kids I mean one of our daughters is super, super tiny but they're really tall and half the things that you know nowadays are so skimpy so little I was just talking to Alta about that like we were just talking about how like it's frustrating trying to find clothes for our kids when they don't really have a lot of stuff available like they don't wear they can't even fit target clothes like that like they can only fit the leggings so and my daughter's super tall like they're like my height or taller i don't understand like where do i shop the woman's section like am i supposed to shop the woman's section for the kids like let me know because my kids can't fit the little cute Target stuff that they be having. They don't even like Target, to be honest with you. Like, they grew out of all that cute Target stuff. I'm gonna look at the jeans, which I don't even dare to. I'm gonna try to see if they have jeans, but. Again. Same thing, and I wanted black jeans. I don't even think they have black jeans. They have these stretch skinny jeans. Their size 12. Our daughter is 12, but like, I feel like once I wash them, they're gonna be short. Like they're not gonna, they're not gonna be, they're gonna shrink. I ran out of this, so I'm gonna get some more because I ran out. I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna finish in here with Target. Y'all will see what I get when I get back home. I just don't want my camera to die here, so I'll be back once I get to the house. All right, I'm back home, y'all. It was getting hot out there. Now I'm gonna put Macy's dress somewhere. All right, as promised, I'm gonna do like a quick haul from H&M and TJ Maxx. Um, I'm gonna try out some things real quick from H&M so you guys can see how it looks and then I'll do a quick haul from TJ Maxx. All right, so here's the first thing that I purchased from H&M. It's like this satin dress. I freaking, I am obsessed with this dress. It was $17.99, it's in a size small. I mean, like, what, what, I mean, it's satin, like, Beautiful. I think satin is such a beautiful material to wear, especially for the spring and summer. Like, what? It isn't that, um, I don't know if y'all can tell, but I can go in the mirror. You see how long it is on me? It's like, so cute. It's right above my knees. Like, I love this little dip. Like, so cute. I can wear this over and over again, over and over again. Satin doesn't go out of style. Like, what? So this is a small from H&M. It's like an ivory color. Oh, it's so sexy. Like, it is so sexy. Like, oh my gosh, love it. So yeah, this was the first thing I got. 
from H&M. It was $17.99, size small. All right, this is my second outfit that I got from H&M. I got this satin sage green shirt from H&M. I got this in extra large. So like when I'm buying clothes, especially from like H&M or Zara, I like to get, I like to get a size extra large or large just because I like to wear my shirts a little loose fitting. And then when I want to wear like some shorts, like it still looks cute. But I always go for like a button up so that I can button it and wear it and look cute in. I love this outfit. Let me show you guys the pants. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the pants are like wide leg. So I just think that looks so cute and chic. Like what? The pants are wide leg. You guys are still on my tripod. The pants are wide leg and then like the shirt is just giving. It's so cute. Another thing is you can tie this whole thing like this to give it a whole completely different look. So you can wear it like that, really cute, really chic, still open, like really cute, endless possibilities. Or you can like leave it like that, like, you know, just really cute and chic, like I love this. Or you can change your pants, wear some shorts instead and just look really cute, button it up. Endless possibilities with the satin, y'all. The satin did not come to play, y'all. Y'all saw me got my um, satin shirt from Zara. Now I have it from H&M. Like, they're not playing, okay? Y'all need to go get y'all some satin this year, period. Oh, yeah, and then the pants, and then the pants are very stretchy. These are a size small. These were $17.99. Were they? Yeah, these were, um... These pants were $17.99, yeah, and like I said, I love how they are like super loose fitting at the bottom, like almost wide leg, like bell bottoms, and they're very, 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 um, but they have that stretchy material, like that spandex stretchy material, so. Super cute, y'all, super cute outfit. I love this outfit. Okay, and then I got this halter top, y'all. The holster tops, H&M is not playing. Like H&M is not playing. This is a size small. This is this was $12.99, I believe. And it's just like a simple, basic holter top. Um, these are the sweatpants that I had on earlier, but I can wear this holter top with like the wide leg pants. I have a few wide leg pants from H&M, like the Gaucho wide leg linen pants. So cute. Or you can wear this with like some mom jeans. It's really stretchy, like the material is really stretchy and it's in this like cream, it's in this cream color. I just am obsessed, like uh, I am obsessed and yes, appreciate the arm fat. <laughs> but I think this is so cute, like uh, so cute. I don't like wearing bras, so this is perfect for me. Okay, and the last thing I got from, my hair is all sticking up. <laughs> the last thing I got from H&M is this bag, y'all. I'm obsessed with this bag. Look at this bag. Look at this bag. Like, it is giving Dior. <laughs> it's definitely giving Dior. It's, it, it got that Christian Dior vibes with the, it, it's giving Dior. It was $24.99 and it comes with the strap. Like, what, like, look at the strap. With the gold, like, this looks so freaking cute. I love, a bag with the strap because I don't like wearing bags like this. I'm a very much crossbody girl. Y'all, this is so cute. Like, so cute. Like, what? So cute. So, yeah, I got this from H&M. Like I said, it's $24.99. That was my last um, item that I purchased from H&M. And then I went to TJ Maxx. Um, I think I filmed a little bit in there, but y'all know what I got. I got two candles. I'm about to put them out right now. Um, vanilla orange, y'all, oh my gosh, vanilla orange. This was $7.99 from Sand and Fog, so it's blessed, $7.99 right there. Oh my gosh, y'all. Yo, I don't know what they put in this candle, but vanilla orange is nothing. I've never smelled that before, and it smells so good. Oh, so good. So freaking good. So good. And then the other one, I'm not, my other candle, I'm not really feeling the packaging or the, 
you know, the whole vibe. It's like this sagey green one. Um, the top, that's what the top looked like. It is um, lemon verbena and it was also $7.99. But I love me a good lemon verbena candle. Um, so, verbena, verbena. I love me a good ver verbena candle or whatever it's called. <laughs> So I'm gonna put these out actually and um, put them out. Okay, and then I showed you guys my earrings. Um, the earrings that I got from TJ Maxx, they're very like simple, but I think they're so cute. Like, let me take the tag off. But yeah, these are just the earrings that I got. Simple studs, I'm a stud girl. I love me some simple studs. Simple, cute studs, I love me some studs. Kinda resemble these ones right here because I lost that one, so yeah. These are real diamonds, so that's why I'm kind of mad that I lost them. But for now, those will substitute and do, that's fine. And then I got my bracelet. I got this one. So I have this one that I just got. It was only 20 bucks. Y'all know I have this one. So I just love the dainty clover like jewelry. So I'm gonna put this one on. I'm gonna switch my hand actually. I'm gonna put it on this side, on my left hand. Cause I always like clean with my right hand. So I'm probably gonna put this on my left hand, but I need help because my kids need to help me put this on because I can't do it myself. Some new earrings, bracelet, two candles, little H&M shopping, and yeah. Okay, so one more package from Amazon. It came while I was out. I'm gonna show you guys what it is. It's so dirty, like the packaging is so dirty. It's, ugh, it's so dirty and it has so much pollen on it. So I ordered some roses off of Amazon. I think these were like 25 bucks for 12 of them. Silk roses, um, latex silk roses, white ones. The head is about three inches, I believe, but I wanted something bigger. I really wanted something bigger. Um, I am making my own bouquet. I just have a vision for a simple white bouquet like a simple simple white bouquet okay maybe it'll be yeah when i put them all together and that's not even all of them hold on when i yeah okay well all right so when i fluff them together and put them all together it'll it'll go i'm gonna take off some of these um like these stems Hopefully they can just cut off because, oh, you can pull them off. I don't need these stems on here. Um, don't need them, but they're individually wrapped. So this is like my bouquet. I wanted something white. I wanted something simple. I wanted something modern. So I just got some white roses. Uh, my bridal bouquet, like my bridesmaids, they have um, bouquets coming from our florist, our florist vendor. So they have theirs, but I wanted to get my own. So I got in, it's right here. I'm gonna put that right here. But yeah, so I also went to Sprouts. I don't know if you guys have a Sprouts, but it's like Trader Joe's. And I ended up getting this um, soap, this Dr. Bronner's um, Pure Castile Soap. It's in the scent Hemp Eucalyptus. Smells really good and I just had to get this. Like, mm, yeah, it smells so strong. So I wanted to get this because of the springtime pollen everywhere. I just wanted to have like some type of eucalyptus. I need to get the eucalyptus bundles, but they wasn't, you know, they didn't have any at Trader, I'm not Trader Joe's, um, Sprouts. So I got this instead. Then these are my flowers, fresh flowers. I freaking love these. These were only $7.99. I'm about to switch out, um, this thing right here this thing i'm about to switch that out and probably put it in the bathroom actually and um put some fresh flowers out 4 35 right now i have a meeting at five o'clock with my virtual assistant to go over a bunch of brand stuff and some goals that i'm working towards um so yeah i'm actually about to heat up a slice of pizza. I have some pizza from yesterday. So I'm about to heat up some pizza while I talk to her. Um, that way I can eat something before I have to go get Macy. Oh, how cute. And Regal. Like, I'm just like, okay, we got Macy's birthday and then Easter. Like, 
I'm not even keeping up with stuff. Like, what the heck? I had no idea. <sighs> so, um, yeah, we're gonna think of something to do for Macy's birthday. And then, um, you know, Easter is not that big of a deal because only person that really sells for Easter is Macy. <laughs> oh yeah, speaking of Easter, I forgot I had a little haul from um, Target. So I got more sandwich bags for the kids' lunch. I got her Easter basket. This was only a dollar. Super cute. It's like glittery and pink. They actually had those for years now. I've been buying those. And then I got some watermelon scrub. I don't know if y'all been watching TikTok, but I learned about this before TikTok, to be honest with you. I always get the tree head scrub, but I had to re-up on the watermelon one because the seeds in it, it's just... It's the best, like y'all need to try this one. They have the strawberry one, but I'm not a fan. But that one, yes. And then I finally found some eye patches. These are for um, dark circles, tired skin. So this is what I got. I just wanna start, um, even though my bags are hereditary, but I wanna start like trying to like, you know, calm them down. So I got the Pacifica Vegan Collagen Eye pads so i'm gonna try those tonight all right guys i'm about to put this stuff up and then eat some pizza and it's 4 42 i'm about to get my assistant um what is that called meeting going so i'll also reach out to princess polly uh pretty oh. little day okay, this, cool. really this really cute brand i found called source unknown um, oh they're really cute you should check them out i think you'll like them they're kind of like a you know you know meshki yeah, I, yes. Mm -hmm. um, so I reached out to them and they have like 20,000 followers. So I think that that should be, you know, hopefully they shoot a quick response back. Yeah, I'm like, wow, they really do. I love me some TikTok. Me too. <laughs> and I saw your, you posted some stories on there. I'm like, yo, they have stories. Now. Yeah, they do have stories. I was on, I was like, okay, they they upgraded to stories now. Okay, that's that's actually good and I just posted some just to see how it would work like I because I wasn't sure what how stories showed up I didn't know if you had to go to that person's profile but like it shows up on the feed just as it would a video a TikTok it just says story instead of you know the video we had I think we have a lot of people that we reached out to like I think there's a lot of companies that were hit so one of them just gotta bite the bait and that'll be it. That'll be all she wrote. Then I can get the ball going and creating the content for them and getting a sponsorship. Yes, so the kids, so the, what do they say? It's out there, the net is cast. Yes, yes, absolutely. Yep. Okay, I will. You take it easy. All right, you too, girl. All right, thank you. All right, it is later on. I'm about to take a shower. I'm gonna do like a whole nighttime routine real quick with you guys because I just want to get in the shower. I want to take these lashes off. I feel like, um, I'm, I don't know why. I feel like I'm sweaty. I don't know, I just feel like I'm weird and sweaty and just like, I want to get in the shower and relax. Wipe my face, even though I don't have no makeup on. I still don't like my face. I have brows on. So yeah, and I want to do, and I want to do these, um, iPads, these gel iPads. So, I might do a quick TikTok. <laughs> Actually, I might do a quick TikTok. Y'all know me with the TikTok-y. <laughs> I be TikToking. That was so corny. <laughs> I don't know if I showed you. I don't think I did, but I did like a little DIY in my shower. Let me show y'all. Okay, so there's my shower head and got my little light because they didn't put a light up here i don't know why like hello they did like you know the little cheap shower but i feel like myself because they was not i was not playing with them okay we not playing
ready to go wind down, literally go into my bed and relax. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was a chill vibe, you know, not too bad, not too bad. <laughs> If you enjoyed this vlog and want to see more, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you'll be alerted whenever I post a new video. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. I always say that, but I'm so grateful. So I'm going to thank you guys all the time. Hello. But yeah, guys, tune into my next vlog. It should be either Saturday or Sunday. No, it should be Sunday or Monday, depending on like how busy I am. But I have a new vlog coming. Um, after this so just make sure you tune in and yeah guys i hope you enjoy your weekend i will see you in my next vlog bye i guess yeah so i'm not with nobody because i don't want to hurt nobody did it over text didn't call me still got love for your mommy